Becoming a Thought Leader, The True Path to Riches The reason that your involvement and passion for the niche is so important is that you are going to need to do some content marketing and brand building if you want to enjoy the very biggest success possible. As we have touched on, this is how you get to the point where you can select nearly any product and then sell hundreds of thousands of copies. But to get to this point, you need to consistently provide free value for your audience. This is important because it's how you're going to build trust in your audience. It's how you're going to create fans. And it's how you're going to get to a point where your audience wants to come back to you time and time again to see what useful information you've put up. Again, the way to get to this point is by posting about a topic that you genuinely love and find interesting. Of course, there is a moral consideration here with great power and all that. The sales funnel. A sales funnel is a term used to describe a series of interactions you have with a potential buyer that will allow you to gradually convince them to buy from you. The thing to remember here is that most often people don't buy from strangers. If someone came up to you on the street and offered to sell you a product, you would almost always say no. In affiliate marketing, we can do this legwork by communicating with them in other ways. That might mean by giving away a free report or inviting them to an online seminar. It might mean getting them to sign up to a mailing list. Use an autoresponder like MailChimp or Aweber. This is how you convert a cold lead into a warm lead. They say that you should try to make five touches before attempting to sell. This way, the lead will know and trust you well enough to consider spending money on your brand. Two of the very best strategies you can lead are to create a mailing list and to sell something that is extremely cheap. The mailing list is a very popular strategy in the world of affiliate marketing. Usually, you will offer your subscribers something free, like a PDF report, in exchange for signing up. From here, you can then communicate with them directly in their inbox, which in turn helps to build rapport and trust. You can then use a sales process via your emails to build hype for products before promoting them to your most receptive audience while not bothering the people who clearly aren't interested. You can do this with a sequence referred to as ADA. Awareness, interest, desire, action. That's four emails that first tease your product, then make it sound interesting, then make it sound amazing, while forcing the readers to wait before giving them the chance to buy.